guys, for Alien Wars, we've got some UAMC, the United American Marine Corps. These are American Marines in space, or American Space Marines. They do the bridgehead. They're like the guys out of, what's that movie? We all land down, all the bugs eat them. I can't remember, but you'll tell me. They're the guys that take the beachhead. They're the guys that would go on to Normandy if it was on a strange planet. Uh, we'll get a look in the box. You've got, uh, tells you this, tells you a little bit of fluff on the back of the box and it shows you, I don't know if that's too close, uh, it is. It shows you uh, some of the, all the bits basically you get in the box. So here we have a little baggie of bases, sprues, and lots and lots and lots of sprues. You get what, uh, is your little card here, your weapon, who you've got, uh, or your various builds, you can build on them, and all your various stats you will need to play the game. They've all got upgrades, so it's all very much like a Space Marine. You've got uh, a little offer, but it ran out of date, so I'm late on these. And you get four, eight, ten sprues, uh, plus a little baggie of bases, here we have, and if we look at some of the big sprues, I, I like these sort of sprues with the bases and all attached to them. I think sprues with bases attached are a great way to go, guys. There's some of the other War Games factoring do this for some of their stuff. It's great. Bases and all there, so you don't end up bases and bits and what all over the place. So each sprue uh, then has three sets of legs, one, two, three sets of legs here each set slightly different so you can do each guy different then you have bodies we have body here body here we have uh is it half of half of a body there there must be another piece of it on here somewhere to go weapons you get a selection of weapons you have one two three four from lighter machine gun type weapons to heavier type weapons you have another one over the bottom here you have what I like on the bottom of the bases, their name. It's great that you can just go in somewhere and you see a nicely painted model, you pick it up, you look at the bottom of it, and it tells you the name of the company on it. You have uh, some little packs here that you can stick onto your guys, you have spare arms. You'll know, guys, I always refer this back to 40K, you've got the Space Marine Ways Boulder and you've got that spare arm to go in these guns. And then you have a various set of heads. That's three. Uh, they're all the same, and these guys here are all basically the same sprue. So, what is it? You get three times uh, four, and four is eight, and four is twelve. Three twelve, thirty-six models that will be in your uh, box set. That's pretty, pretty damn good. Thirty-six models for space marine type guys. So, going to go now. I'll build some of these. Starship Troopers, that's the name of the movie. These are the guys that do the Starship Troopers and get eaten. But <laughs> maybe not. Go, go, build some of these, and I'll catch you in the second half, guys. Guys, for Alien Wars, we have our little United American Marine Corps guys built. I built four of them. I just built one of each, pretty much. If we look at them here, we have our first guy here with your average sort of size of the weapon. Slightly bigger and some smaller than the big weapon. It goes together, no bother. He has his little helmet on. He's got his little pack. He's got his body armor on there. That's not huge and chunky like some of the other models you get. It's just all of a realistic sort of size. We have our next guy here. He's got a little... Uh, Uzi type, that type of fast firing small gun that will spread out a lot of bullets. He's got a backpack. Mistake I made in the first half of this video is I saw a backpack and I thought it was half a body. But it's a backpack, so from each of the 12 sprues you can build two guys. You've got spare legs, spare guns, uh, spare heads, so you can have lots of bits to use. Uh, if we have our next guy, it's another guy with one of the smaller guns. Again, straightforward, get a little cap on. He looks more like your commander with his cap on. But for me, going to battle with a cap or a helmet, it's up to yourself. And finally, we've got our guy with our heavy big gun here. 
again straightforward to build the only thing with all of these is the usual thing they are uh, you have to fit arm and arm and gun uh, and sometimes it can be a bit wobbly the way i do is i get the gun arm and i stick it on i always use plastic glue stick it on and leave it till it's well set and then you can wiggle about with the other arm and you get it on without any huge issues they're a nice looking little unit guys they go together well scale wise just a bit of a comparison here they are slightly smaller than a space marine this is quite a dynamic pose guy with a combi milled at great weapons uh so if you want it you could use them in other game systems they are that 28 mil sort of true scale for alien wars they will look the part a nice paint job on these maybe roman could paint this one at some time in the future nice paint job on one of these and they will work it's up to you guys will you play alien wars will you use these for something else stick some comments in and i'll get on and see you in the next one